Hello, this is Ethan, uh, Lord Noodles, and this is my third video for tonight. I got a package from Korea, and it's actually from Hong Kong. And this is my K-pop package. Uh, this is Da Vici's third mini album, Love Delight, featuring the song Don't Say Goodbye. I can't read it, but I believe it's that one. And also Love, Oh Love, which I believe is number two. Um, let's open it up. As you can see, it's all shiny because the cellophane is still on it. I have my scissors. Let's expedite this. This album rocked. I don't know why I didn't buy it sooner. I actually, I kind of know why. So I bought the wrong album by accident. Uh, last shipment. <laughs> it's not a big problem. I still like Davici quite a bit. Um, but, yeah. Um, this one, I, this is one of the first things I learned in K-pop. Um, one of the first ballad I learned was uh, don't say goodbye and then I watched that video and oh my god that is depressing and good but also just depressing whoever writes this video music videos for um core contents media who is the company who owns da Vici's rights um, whoever writes those music videos they're either entirely way too depressed or way too genius with their videos <laughs> Uh, this isn't a standard jewel case. Nothing too special about the packaging. Um, it feels like... You, I can feel the injection molding over here. Uh, you can kind of see it in the light. Mm, feels funny. Oh well. Let's open it up. And we have the duo here. Uh, the CD itself is nice compared to some of the other videos. CD of art. Behind it, we have a name, at least, which is fine. Over here, we have the art, art book. Let's find out what's inside it. Page one-ish. Just the duo. Looks very similar to that. They're wearing the same outfits, at least. Let's see. Are they wearing that there? I believe they are. So you can tell... How much of one photo shoot they used to film these. Well, that's something I notice sometimes in these. Or how many photo shoots they took. I believe we have the, um, the song and the lyrics over here. Nice picture of Min Kyung over here. Hey More of um, this. She is a really high collar. Look at that. That's like Victorian high. You can't show any skin except her shoulders, apparently. <laughs> uh, they are so pale. I mean, it's also photoshopped, but she is quite pale. Well, that's more interesting outfits here. Take a look. Um, it's like a mix of East and West, almost. I'm not entirely sure on Min Kyung. On Hayri, it looks like a jacket and a dress. Neat jacket, though. Got floral... Um, that word, I can't think of. Embroidery, I think. Yeah. <laughs> They're in a forest. It looks arboreal. I don't know if that means anything to you guys. <laughs> it is a neat outfit. It has like a corset to it, also. I hear my cat coming up to me. Neat photos, still. Um, a lot of editing, but that's okay. See, look at this. It's mostly just foggy white light. This is not my lamp. This is the photo itself. My lamp is also causing a little bit of glare, but only on my tilt it. <laughs> I wonder how they asked her to do this shot. <laughs> hey, go sit in a tree. We'll shoot an image of you. <laughs> Wear all white and climb this tree. I don't know. Maybe it's photoshopped. Anyway, this is the album. Something I noticed is that the lesser name albums, no matter how big they are or how popular and how much talent they have, they're still not as big as the regular pop groups. Um, which is fine, they fill different niches. But what it comes down to is that these packaging for these type of CDs is much simpler than like the Speed album I shot earlier. I'll link back to that. That thing is holy crap, there's so much stuff to it. 
And it's not even special edition, that's normal. Um, yep, this is the Love Delight album. I will be listening to it very much, very soon. Uh, check out my website, and hope to see you in the next video.